The evidence is overwhelming. The aftermath of much of the destruction and the deaths of children last summer in Gaza was recorded on video. In total, the UN said 540 children were killed. Yet UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon, in his annual report on children in armed conflict around the world to the Security Council, has not included Israel on the damning list of countries and groups that kill children. Al Jazeera understands both Israel and armed Palestinian groups were on the list in the original draft drawn up by the UN Special Representative. The draft report had Israel and Palestinian armed groups on it, the yes. report you sent upstairs. This when is it a came draft. back downstairs, it didn't have them on anymore. Is that true? Yes, but this means that the, the, the decision of the Secretary General, we are uh, uh, supposed to prepare the, uh, the decision of the Secretary General. We are not the one who decides. Jazeera's learnt there was high-level lobbying by Israel and the US to persuade Ban Ki-moon to keep Israel off the list. There's, there's really no explanation for it other than it's a political decision because the, the overwhelming documentation really should trigger a listing. So did Ban Ki-moon bow to political pressure? Member states have never been shy in expressing uh, their opinion uh, to the Secretary General about what should be in or out of the report, whether it's this report this year or in the previous years. Ultimately, uh, it's the Secretary General's uh, report. Uh, he, stands, uh, he stands by it. You just need to read this full report to see the obvious contradictions. The report says the number of Palestinian school children killed in 2014 was the third highest anywhere in the world. It says the number of schools damaged or destroyed was the highest anywhere in 2014. And then you look at the annex, the list that's supposed to summarise it all, listing, among other things, parties and states that kill or maim children or engage in attacks on schools, and Israel's name is not there.